So the question is, what is Joe doing today? That's the question of the day, every day. And today they are again demolishing another house that um, lived out its usefulness here. And we'll see the house on the inside and you'll see how little construction there was back in the time when they first started these houses. We're on the corner of Fire Road and Larnard Avenue. Wow, this is like metal. This isn't, look how thin the house is. This is not um, the construction of houses today. Let's go on the other side. Scooping everything up. Look how thin this house was. Look at the little tiny metal plate that was the wall. So when these houses were first constructed, the mobile homes, they didn't expect that people were gonna live in them full time. So they really weren't built for that. And eventually they realized they were really no longer mobile. People were uh, moving them around and living in them permanently. Today's construction is unbelievable. It's like site-built houses. And in 1976, the federal government created the HUD code, which um, made construction. Woo! Look how tiny the insulation is there. It's a good thing I moved. All the wind is blowing the dirt over in that direction. This house has a lot of mold on the outside. The windows look really um, moldy. This is a, a wonderful location. It's got a huge yard. So um, there is a wonderful house that we'll be building here. This family um, abandoned the house. Uh, it's very hard to resell a house that has uh, this kind of construction. So I know in our culture we use the word mobile home to describe these houses on a regular basis. Uh, but when people use that word or trailer, they're speaking about um, language that was of a different construction than what we're building now. And unfortunately, we have a bit of a stigma. People used to think it was uh, housing for the poverty level, but um, it's definitely not. It's built in a factory, and there's no um, weather conditions that affect the building of the house, and that's why it's more economical, but it's not poverty. They're, they're beautiful. We've had people come to us thinking affordable was government housing, and we don't offer that. So stay tuned while we build this house. If you're interested in filling out the resident application and getting approved to live in this land lease community. We'd love to have you join us. Email me at info at dolanhomes.com.